So Duffer is a realistic live contender for you, Keith. I think so. Whether or not he he would be interested himself, I'm not too sure. But yeah, the way I think, you know, Shelbourne obviously playing against Shamrock Rovers, Pats teams in the league that are generally better than them. They put it up against them. Very rarely take a pump, and, and you know, on paper they're not as good as the rest of the teams in the league. But they punch above their weight. They're hard to play. And yeah, it's yeah good I think point. It's a clear message. It's a very good point that you made there. I'll watch a lot of football, like football, uh, like Keith. And again, if you're looking at a manager in a team set up and saying who gets the very best out of what he's got. Duffers is probably up there Watch a lot of shells play if you look in terms of their organisation how well drilled uh, they are you know uh, pound for pound can't match up to a lot of the teams in the league in, in terms of maybe individual quality or money to spend but uh, yeah very often you come out of Talca Park watching Shelburne and think you know what that was probably as good as they could have done uh, probably the Pats game was probably a good example of that not too long ago as well so yeah I think his, his reputation has grown Damien I just hope that people don't look at Damien and go oh, it's, it's lit. electricity what Shelbourne come on we've been serious here we've we got we to gotta park that a little bit and hopefully people don't use maybe Stephen Kenny his uh, CV in terms of his um, track record in the League of Ireland football and suddenly come to the conclusion that oh, we can't go down that road again yeah. we've been there that kind of simplistic view on things Jerry. you know what I mean yeah. got to judge each, each individual player on his merits and Damien with his, his CV his relationship with the Irish fans the Irish team and in terms of how this relative success he's had already in his short managerial career I'm not saying maybe now is the time for him but no reason why he shouldn't be in the conversation